What's up everybody? Hey, I'm P here. Wanted to show you some two really cool uh, Sublime Text libraries that I found really useful with JSON. Um, we are going to uh, generate a report here using a little tool called uh, Pali. Pally. Um, that's pretty cool that hopefully um, in the short term I'll do another screencast on, but um, it's an accessibility report that can kick it out as JSON. So I just ran a report that's going to do an accessibility check on phd.edu and kick it out to report.json. So if we look at this in Sublime Text, uh, by default it's not going to look too good. So here we go. So you got this one big long line of uh, JSON. So what can we do about that? Uh, well, there's two libraries that I just checked out. One is called... Uh, let's see if we can list installed packages. Uh, one is called JSON reindent. So if you search on package manager for JSON reindent, uh, reindent, you'll be able to download that. And that's pretty straightforward. Um, it just takes a big long line of JSON. And if we highlight it, uh, shift command P and type JSON. We can see that this is now one of our options to re-indent a, a file or selection. Hit that and it'll process it and beautifully print it out as uh, perfectly formatted JSON. Pretty sweet. Um, now another really cool uh, library that I uh, stumbled upon while trying to find that uh, re-indent library was uh, another one called show tree. So JSON tree. Um, uh, pardon me, it's called. So search it on package manager for JSON tree. And what that does is it allows you to um, browse uh, the structure of a JSON uh, array or object. So as we can see here, this is um, the first instance of an array, which is marked as zero. And we can see that it's an object. And within that object is code, context, message, selector, type, uh, type code. So Pretty handy uh, if you're working with uh, really big uh, JSON structures. Um, you can probably visualize that a little easier. Um, and if you didn't have the re-indent, let's check it out and see what that would look like if we didn't re-indent that. So we'll take it back to where it was and show tree. And as you can see, even though it's not indented properly and everything, uh, it's still showing us the correct structure of the JSON um, array. So pretty sweet, pretty handy. Hope you like it. Later.